Hello everybody, Lord Almighty here. Today is Sunday, June 24th, 2018, and uh, since the topwater bite treated me so well yesterday, I decided to see if it could continue today at one of my favorite local ponds. But instead of small mouths, today I'm after large mouths, and I'm hoping they will be just as kind to me as the small mouths were yesterday. So let's see if I can't keep that hot, hot top water bite chugging along. I've gotten a few a few hits on this top water so far, which is encouraging. They were all from small fish. This pond is uh, it's loaded with small bass. Population's actually kind of it's kind of overpopulated and stunted. But there are definitely a few bigger ones in here too. That's what I'm hoping for today. Nice uh, nice three, four, five pounder to come up and smack this top water would be real nice. There we go. That was an aggressive hit. All right. Not too bad. That's an above average fish for this pond. On what else? The whopper plopper. It works on largies too. It's a decent fish, maybe pushing a pound. There's a ton of bikers whizzing around today. A lot of people out. I mean, it's a gorgeous day for it. Got a group of people across the way there who are swimming and fishing. They got their 1990s butt rock blaring away. God, I remember hearing some of those songs in high school. Even back then I knew it was garbage. There we go. Feels like a small fish. Hit it hard. But the hit belies the size of the fish. Alright, well, not all the fish caught on the whopper plopper are whoppers. There we go. Oh, he's off. He just nipped the back hook. I saw he was he was barely hooked. I'm not surprised that fish came off. Glad he wasn't very big. I'd be a lot more upset about it. Oh, there's another one. Let's see if this one can stay buttoned. There we go. Another little guy. All right. I'll take it. It's been a while since my last bite, and all of a sudden, two in a row. There we go. Fish on. This feels a little better than the ones I've been getting. Still not too big. There we go. Sometimes that back hook just gets right in them. Alright. There we go. Alright. Little bass. I think I saw some blood coming out. Hope he'll be alright. Didn't look like I hit his gills. There's another one. Look at that. Very next cast. Fish are coming in bunches now. 
I must be must be finding schools of them because they will do that in this pond they'll they'll roam around in packs of like five or six fish another small one go tell grandma I want to say hi Oh my goodness, look at this. I've been having a few of these guys attack this bait. Look at that. He's a little bit bigger than the lure. There we go. That's another little dinker, it looks like. Yep, sure enough is. Man. He was barely hooked. I'm actually lucky he didn't come off. Well, if I was really lucky, that thing would have been four pounds. Oh, snake. They're surprisingly fast for animals with no legs. There we go. And a little one. those hooks in my fingers I'd be very upset he behaved like a good fish should oh another micro bass just kind of kind of kissed it and it bit him Nice aquarium sized bass. Oh boy. This might be the smallest one yet. My goodness. How did he even get the hook in his mouth? Ah, I could use you as a spinnerbait trailer. All right, everybody, I'm gonna pack it in because uh, it's actually getting pretty warm out here and I didn't bring any water with me, which is actually kind of stupid, especially considering how much fat guys sweat in the heat. So uh, I'm gonna head over to the nearest convenience store, get something cold to drink, and uh, then I'm gonna cut this video together. So uh, wasn't a banner day, didn't get anything big. We caught a a decent sized one to start the day, uh, but they just seem to be getting progressively smaller as the day wore on. Um, but hey, you know what? They can't all be lunkers. And at the end of the day, it was a gorgeous day to be outside. I caught fish, I had fun, and that's what it's all about. So thank you all so much for joining me, and I will see you on the next adventure.